Hi, Jupiterines! Welcome to another vlog. Today, I'm sharing with you how I celebrated a small win of 200 subscribers on YouTube. My name is Meliana Monik. I live in Brooklyn, New York with my husband and I am sharing with you my journey as a first generation immigrant of creating a life beyond my wildest dreams. So you will be seeing some unusual and then some more usual perspectives and life experience. This celebration idea got sparkled by my taste buds when I was having this unusual meal that we prepared with my husband, which was like mustard, turkey, egg, arepa, and some other sauces, plus our usual salad of tomato and avocado. So I've been definitely thinking about how can I celebrate this milestone because it might be a small number, but it really took a lot of work, dedication, and constant healing for me to find my voice, to discover myself, to get comf confident and comfortable to share my story and create content consistently. So this is a big deal and I wanted to stay within the budget or actually do it for free. And we had some ice cream as well with fruit and I had my favorite June kombucha. This is my favorite drink. I love it so much. And then I actually went and cleaned up the tub so we can take a nice relaxing bath, um, do a meditation, and um, yeah, this is the fun part of the whole thing. I think this is the most fun of them all. Okay, no, I'm being sarcastic, though um, I don't mind cleaning it, especially when I'm so excited to enjoy it. I absolutely am okay with cleaning it up and then going inside and just being like, Ah, so beautiful, so lovely feeling in the water. What you're seeing here is a thing that I left soaking in water and some bleach just so it doesn't infect because it's a, a thing that I use to dry the dishes in the kitchen and I have a couple of them. So it was time to do some deep cleaning on that. And now I'm going to deep clean the top with some Ajax and a uh, scrub I want to take this moment to actually share something with you that is very important remember to celebrate the small things small milestones you don't just need to celebrate when you graduate from college you can celebrate when you get accepted you can celebrate every single time you take a course and you do well on it um, celebrate you waking up in the morning and actually going to that course. Celebrate you going to the gym. Small things is very important for them to celebrate because as the saying says, big shots are just small shots who keep on firing. And if you are firing, then you've got to celebrate that fire every single time. Um, or if you can't do it every single time, then like me, set up some small achievable milestones and celebrate them each time that way you get to celebrate yourself and you get to learn to value the work that you do every single day because you are worthy and you deserve it one thing that's a must to my bath and that is epsom salt i add a couple of different ones um, just a handful of one and the other i don't want too much of it um, because i don't think it's good to have too much of it Another thing that I enjoy adding to my bat, but this is just a preferred thing, is adding some flower petals. And I found some, but I only had a few left. I ran out of them. And when I say celebrating for free, I mean using the things that you already have at home. Now everything is ready to just go in and enjoy it. Please subscribe, like, comment below on your experience and how do you celebrate the small wins. And please remember to always celebrate your wins and your accomplishments no matter how big or how small they are because the universe sends you more events and accomplishments to celebrate.